this man's striking credentials. Prevailing wisdom is he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. He has to. You know, this is what got him to the show. It was being able to use the hands to set up the kicks. We all talk about the high-level boxing background of this young man. But as he's developed, he's developed great knees. Yeah. He's developed great timing, great counter skills, and also the beautiful right high kick. The right high kick is something he hides very well as he follows with a jab right hand left hook. High kick comes over the top, and he can put you to sleep. No doubt about it. He will try to put on a striking clinic once again here tonight. Well, we probably trot out the term well-rounded in modern-day mixed martial arts more than we should, but this fighter certainly fits the bill. Oh, 110%. He can do everything inside the octagon. Where he is most comfortable is inside of that eight-sided structure where right. most men are terrified of being. But for this gentleman, he only wants to be there. When you try to wrestle him, he's able to defend takedowns. If you dare stand and strike with him, he can knock you out. He's got all the tools necessary to become a UFC champion. His first martial art, mixed martial arts, <laughs> and that's not always the case. He believes that he should have a lot of it there. as this fight gets underway, and you hate to call any fighter on this UFC roster a specialist, but on one side, you have a definite striker taking on a true five-tool player. And you see a guy in the striker who knows exactly who he is. He knows where the fight needs to be. He knows what he has to do in order to be successful. Let's see if he can keep his opponent off of him. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Well, you saw the tail of the tape. He has a reach advantage and made good use of it there with that punch. Big, powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Archer, right, so there's the early takedown. He told us on Thursday he didn't necessarily see a path to victory. If he couldn't get takedowns, that is certainly a good sign. Right away, he got the takedown. I don't believe they could have imagined that it would work so well so early. Great job. Crazy accuracy and efficiency with these ground and pound strikes here. And if you're the opponent, you've got to intelligently defend or the referee's going to stop. you got to defend. But you can see him now start to gain posture and the intensity at which he's throwing these ground strikes is starting to improve. It's starting to elevate because he knows that he can get the finish. Man, striking class is in session. Beautiful punch there. Great job landing. What a damaging punch. You got to check these low leg kicks. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. Tags him with the left hand. All right, so he lands another jab now, just snapping that thing off, DC. I believe that the jab was lost in mixed martial arts initially. But now it has been found, and it's been found by this young man in this octagon tonight. Oh, he's got it going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch land. He's going to try to take him down. There you go. Oh, he slams him to the ground. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Oh, Bob Mercier's has got full mount now. Side control now. Keep it busy here off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. Well, he continues to manhandle him here on the ground. All right, working inside the closed guard now. Oh, nice job working hard, posting, and getting back up. Look at the turnover in that kick. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Look at how he drives his knee right into his opponent's midsection. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch his punch like this puts a smile on my face. Got the single collar tie. Oh, and he lands another takedown. 
down here, just doing a nice job, not telegraphing his shot, clean entries. The Olympian's gotta like what he sees. I mean, over and over, he gets to the legs before his opponent reacts. By beating him on the entry, now it's up to the opponent to keep up. But this guy's playing chess. His opponent's playing checkers. He's playing chess. He can't keep up. Once he gets to his legs, he's got to beat him defensively before he gets his hands locked around his legs or his body. Just out of range with that left hook. A oh, little single collar tie there. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Shot a double leg. Oh, how about the slam there? That one cannot feel good. Man, isn't it fun to watch this dude work on the mat? He's unbelievable how fluid he is in his motions on the mat. Oh, working hard to get back up again, and he's there. He lands flush with that right hand. Well, you saw us reference it in the tail of the tape, DC. He's got the reach advantage and certainly made good use of it there in landing that chip. Big punch lands to the middle. 20 seconds left. Just out of the range with that right hand. Oh, single collar tie here. And he landed the right hand there. That horn sounds means we have reached the end of round one. Well, what a round it was, especially from a striking standpoint, DC, take us through. High level striking. I mean, this is what people come through the doors to see. Two men stand on a quarter, chest to chest, forehead to forehead, and let it all fly. I'm surprised nobody went out, but it does excite me for the next round. All right, second round now underway. I'm no analyst, but a little bit of a feeling out process there in round one. And that's a part of being in the octagon with someone that's so skilled. You cannot just go after those guns are blazing. Both of these young men are trying to find the right moment to attack. Big head kick land. Effective strike there by the Korean Super Bowl. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may float a right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land. He's just got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. Look at him drive his shin into his whole body with that body kick. Right hand punches the clinch. Pushing forward now with strikes, and now he's able to secure the takedown. Posturing up now. And now the damage is about to start. Well, pretty good work off of the bottom here by the Korean Super Bowl. Left hand is true. That will absolutely work. He throws it like a piston back and forth. He landed that beautiful left hand. Both fighters get up now. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Oh, tags him with that uppercut. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Great punch. What does he follow that uppercut with next time he lands it so effectively? Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Oh, look at that jab. Snapped his head back. His jab gets to the target so fast. Always brings his hands right back to his face. Oh, collar tie. And there comes the separation now. Nice move just once. And both guys really throwing with authority. Man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Kick to the body by Obama Mercier. Joy's uppercut is blocked. Looked like for a minute he had a window there. It closed quickly. Obama Mercier's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Ooh, what a punch. Man, he's 
He's just got a great feel for the striking realm early in this one. The timing is on point. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up. Oh, nice straight punch there. Must be nice to have a reach advantage like this, DC. Well, there it is again. He just continues to keep landing those takedowns, scoring a lot of points. His opponent has showed a pretty good get-up, but not sprawling, not stopping the shot. He's got to sprawl earlier. He's got to defend a little bit earlier if he's going to stop this guy. This guy is so committed to his wrestling that he will continue to attack him over and over again. Well, how about the speed on that reversal there? I mean, I know you can get out of some bad spots, but not with that type of speed. You cannot allow him to get leverage on the bottom. What a sweep. Well, hard to win fights in mixed martial arts from the bottom, but nice work here in that position by Obama Mercier. All right, well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you gotta be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. All right, feet on the hips here. Joy gets back up again, nicely done. Good punch. Whiffs on the right hand. Some nice back and forth action here. He blocks the punch. Oh, just out of range with that right hand. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Hands high, hands high. That's a big strike right there. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. Over and over, he's landed a big body kick. Oh! oh flips him over the top. What a huge takedown. I mean, do I survive that, or did no, I read John, my last round? Absolutely not. Nice. You don't survive that. It's over. It's over, John. Well, he's in a compromising spot here, DC. You gotta figure out a way to get back to your feet. Side control now, DC. A lot of options at his disposal from here. Fine, All right, round fine, three fine. coming up next. Well, no, 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 no. All right, listen, man. You're doing great, okay? I want more of the same. This guy can't do anything to you anywhere. You are controlling the entire fight. Stay sharp. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays from that last round. Unbelievable to see these high-level competitors get in each other's face, tuck their chin, bite down on the mouth guard, and just let it all hang out over the course of five minutes. All right, so back-to-back -back entertaining rounds. We'll see how it goes in this round. We'll see which corners sort of maximize those 60 seconds on the screen. This is what happened. Very skilled, very evenly matched fighters coming together. Nobody has really taken a lead in this fight. Let's see who does it going to the next one. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Nice punch by Obama Mercier. Collar tie now. Oh, big right hand, yes. Oh, Tom Mercier's lower jaw looking extremely swollen now. Trying to establish that jab. Joy gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Just misses there with the left. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? I mean, this guy is really focused on those punches to the head inside of the clinch. See what a punch. And they separate. Clean with the right hook. Wind it up on the right there to no avail. 
Oh, and there he goes again, working off that beautiful jab. He continues to keep his opponent at distance. I mean, keeps him at bay with that beautiful, precise jab. It is like a piston. It goes in and out, and before his opponent can even realize what hit him, he's already hitting him with another one. Right. I love, love watching this man fight because of that beautiful, educated jab. Oh, and he lands another punch there, and you can tell at this point he is going right at that cut on his opponent. Right at the cut on the eye, just making sure he knows that I'm going to be targeting it. Keep your hands up, and when the hands go up, he will then change the target down low, trying to find finishes. Good punch, Lance. Not sure if he's lighter on his feet or what it is, but these last couple of rounds, he's been far more aggressive, a lot more pressure. Oh, he's really starting to light him up now. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Massive kick down the kick lane. Down the target with that left hand. All right, so you got to be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't want to mess around for too long. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Well, he's more than content to work off of his back, DC, where he has been a magician in his UFC career. Well, he's staying pretty effective here, fighting off of his back. Nice strike landed there by the bottom by Obama Mercier. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. Close guard here. He's very comfortable here working off his back, DC. Just misses with the straight right. Oh, combination lands. You want to talk about putting strikes together. Beautiful execution. There. And every one of them are landing. He's overwhelming him with different attacks. Punch over the top. Oh, he lands another strike to the body here. Really starting to connect on a lot of strikes to the midsection here in the latter stages of this fight. Big kick lands. He loaded up on that right hand too. Real nice body kick lands. Look at that leg. Good stick. 15 seconds. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. How good is that right hand? Just missed with the left there. Right now we take a look back at some of the highlights he has had his kicking game going early and often tonight. I mean, on point, right? He knew that this was going to be a way for him to take control of this fight. He's used those kicks to really put him out ahead, and I'm not sure if his opponent has the ability to adjust and stop him from landing these over and over. All right, so next round underway here, and you got to admire the stamina that both of these guys still exuded towards the end of that round. Both men put a particular focus on their cardiovascular commitment in this training camp, and it's clearly paid dividends here tonight. We have two legitimately fresh fighters here as we hit this next round. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. That's some good takedown defense right there. Single leg attempt, no good. Oh! Let's go, I want you to kick hard to that leg. Nice punch, Lance. Hold your head. Straight right hand, no good. There's no kill on that leg kick. That right hand landed. Just out of range with the big right hand. Oh, made good use of his size there as he lands the flush take. Nice, low single takedown. 
and they both stand up. Well, we wondered earlier why there weren't as many body strikes. He's making up for lost time here. Shot to the body connects, and that bears watching. That's gonna hurt this opponent. Back and forth we go here! Leg kick. All right, single collar tie now. Oh, big punch land. Well, the left hook has been there at times, not that time. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Don't finish his fight. Oh! Big hit. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Obama Mercier. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very busy. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Double leg takedown. Oh, nice job to get back up again. You don't want to hang out on the ground with this guy. Nice punch land over the top. All right, what do you think? Another takedown attempt here. It seems like every time he's gone to the well, it's been there tonight. When you're that successful with any one thing, why would you change it? He's going to shoot for another takedown, and I would almost be willing to bet he's going to secure it. I'll take your action. Okay. Nice. Oh, just out of range with that punch attempt. And going for the takedown here. That will absolutely work. It will absolutely work because every time he shoots, he is 100% certain he is going to secure a takedown. Oh, nice work from the bottom. Tags him with the punch. Oh, he's got the knee on the belly. Could be trouble defensively. All right, so he's sort of turtled up here. Not great body language. Perhaps he's trying to bait him in a little bit. What a punch. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Whiffs on that offering. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Straight right hand now, just misses. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Obama Mercier. Oh, and he lands another huge knee there as the taller fighter uses his leg again. He's doing a really good job of getting on that high cross and just following the action. Well, he's in a compromising spot here, DC. You got to figure out a way to get back to your feet. All right, side control now. Outstanding ground and pound here. Somewhat of a lost art in MMA, at least in terms of making sure that every strike counts. Not an issue for him. He's making every single one of them count. He is not putting that. He's not touching. Every punch that lands, he wants you to feel it. Nice punch land over the top. So the crowd voicing its appreciation after that round. We had a knockdown courtesy of a punch midway through. DC, here's your highlight. It was straight. He threw him in combination and landed that big punch that really did hurt his opponent. Lesser men would have been done. He's got a tough guy in front of him. He will have to go back to this again. He will have to get back to this action if he wants to get the desired finish. All right, the action continues here and now as our That's next fun, round gets you underway. The previous That's round might be confused for a round of the year, but pretty good action. It was a pretty good round. Not every round is going to have you standing up out of your seat. You understand that you are watching the highest level of fighting in the entire world in the UFC. Now connects with a right. Nice punch by Choi. Well, he's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tucked, the hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job. Oh, beautiful job with the ankle pick to get him down. Now we'll see where he chooses to go from here. Got the ankle pick. Let's see how he advances from this position. Oh, nice jab up top by the Korean Super Bowl. 
just missing on the uppercut there. All right, lands a kick there, pretty well done. Really good accuracy landing that kick. Straight right, he misses. Nice jab, follows it up with a nice right hand. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Well, his opponent tonight has done a good job of getting back to his feet, and just as I say that, planted on his back again. Another takedown over and over and over. Look, man, I'm a wrestler, and I love takedowns, but come on, do something different. Press punch, <laughs> do one of the special moves. I mean, geez, uh, takedown after takedown. Man, this is some serious ground and pound. He's trying to put this dude's head, like, through the canvas. He's one of the better ground and pound fighters we have in the entire UFC, and you're seeing why. All right, close guard now. You gotta be careful though, he's got a lot of submissions off his back. All right, inside his opponent's guard here, DC. You don't wanna play around here too long. No, you gotta either have two hands in or two hands out. Our guys start to attack triangle. He did a great job securing that ankle pick, but he did not react fast enough to secure the top position. And just like that, back to a standing position. We'll see who has the advantage. Oh, nice punch there by Obama Mercier. All right, it's late in the fight now. I don't need to be a judge to tell you that he is clearly losing. What is a fighter's mentality when you know you need a finish or you're getting an L? This is when you gotta go to the Nate Diaz mentality. Kill or be killed. You gotta throw everything at your opponent because if this thing goes to the judges, you are not gonna win this fight. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Trying to establish that jab once again. Choi gets hit by that leg kick. Set the pace and hit him first. Great punch landed with so much power. <laughs> Blocks the shot. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Another punch to the head. He's really turning every part of himself into those strikes to the head. All right, so able to get the hands going once again. He lands another punch. Nice work on the feet by the Korean Super Bowl. Well, he's been good tonight, but he missed with that one. So there it is, longer reach, paying dividends as he counters with a punch. Oh, that's a good strike there by Choi. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Oh, beautiful jab there, man. It's like you know what's coming, can't stop it. I mean, you have to anticipate that jab coming or he will batter and bruise you with that single strike. He's got to be careful dipping his head when he's throwing that jab. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Nice punch there by Obama Mercier. Strong hook to the head there by Short. Back to the left hand now, unable to connect. Back and forth we go. Nice kick. These guys are going at it. Straight punch lands. Twenty seconds to go in the fight. Obama Mercier gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. Whoa! The final horn sounds! All right, let's look back at some of the action. DC, they go the distance tonight, but you gotta think he won over the judges with his striking acumen tonight. Yeah, you got to watch one of the best strikers in the entire UFC. He did everything so well, and in my opinion, he should cruise to a very easy decision.
right, the official decision is in. It resides with the venerable Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest 50-45. Played the winner by unanimous decision, the Korean Super Bowl, Do Ho Chong. All right, nice job.